Hello, this is Suzu Fire TV with your second stress tutorial. Um, in the last one, um, my microphone is broken so I can use the, so I can talk during it. But it's all, it's all fixed right now, so, yeah. Okay, so we saw my first video. I'm gonna let this right here, this is the stage. The sprite area, scripts, costumes, down, and walk. Um, so, um, right now we're just going to use this sprite right here, this character. And we're just going to do a simple script that makes him move left and right. Okay, so, first thing you want to do with any game, with any project, I'm just getting this block right here. This is the block that initializes the entire thing. Wait. So when you click this green flag, it will do whatever is below this, whatever's attached to it. Um, so let's go back into the motion category. I'm gonna select the move 10 steps block. Actually, let me change that to 20. Okay, so when the green flag is clipped, click, it's going to move 20 steps forward. Click. And as you can see, it is moved slightly forward. You can keep clicking it, and it'll move. But we don't want it to, um, so you will have to keep clicking the green flag in order for it to move. We want to make it automatic, so it continually loop. So I'll move this out of the way for a second. And this right here, this is um a control block, forever block. What it does, it constantly repeats forever whatever is in here. So if we did this, it'll move until we get to the edge of the screen, of course. Then it won't move any further. So when the green fly is flipped, like forever do this. So now as I said we're going to make a move both left and right. So what we want so what we're going to want to do is so when it hits the edge, hits the edge, it turns around and moves this way. Just back and forth. This is where this one comes in. If on edge, bounce. That's pretty explanatory. So it hits the edge, then it'll bounce. So look at this. It's upside down coming back. We don't really want that. So what we're going to do, these three right here, I'm going to control how this can rotate. So right now it's just in free rotation, I can rotate however I want, like this. If I choose this option, I can only move, I can only turn left and right, like this. And I'll choose this one, and I can't rotate at all. No matter how we... Okay, so for our purposes, we're long going to choose the only phase left and right option. So, now let's start it up. And move left and right. Actually, we're going to want to make it a little bit slower. Okay, so move left and right. Like so. Now you have created your very first scratch script. And when you want to stop, just click the red stop sign. You can also go into presentation mode, full screen, and click it. So do the same thing. Very useful for a mobile game. You want to have a full screen. Um. So that's your first scratch tutorial. This is through the fire, through the fire TV signing out.